let's admit it, who hasn't enjoyed leftover pasta when not in the mood to cook something fresh? But most people don't know about the most efficient way to microwave this pasta. It'll heat evenly if you dig a hole in the middle, making the dish look like a large donut. To keep your pastries fresh, cover them with a slice of bread. If you want to keep your cookies in a bag, put some bread inside. This will keep them soft and prevent them from drying. You can use rubber bands to tie plastic bags, or you can cut the top of a plastic bottle. Place it over an open bag this way and just screw the two parts shut. When making yourself a BLT, which stands for bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwich, lace the slices of bacon together this way. This way, your sandwich will have proper coverage. The best way to slice bread is upside down, starting on the tougher side. This way, you'll preserve the shape of the loaf. You should also wait until the bread has cooled down to room temperature before cutting it. When you're having drinks outside, cover the glasses or cups with cupcake liners. This will stop all kinds of bugs from getting into the drinks. Try putting ice cream containers in Ziploc bags before storing them in the freezer. If you don't do this, the next day, you'll have problems scooping the product. But inside the plastic bag, your ice cream will remain soft. Instead of opening a bag of popcorn the traditional way, rip a hole in the side of the bag. This way, your hands won't get greasy. Ever dreamed of a perfect sandwich where nothing sticks out and the filling is spread evenly? Here you go. Simply cut round sandwich fillings in half. This way, they'll cover the entire surface of the bread. It's possible to turn the metal plate on your stapler's base. If you rotate it, stapler pins will be bent outward. It'll allow you to staple something only temporarily, and the staples can be easily removed later. Separating pomegranate seeds can be quite challenging, but not if you use this method. First, take a very sharp knife and make four to six score cuts going from the top to the bottom, cutting through the skin, but not the fruit itself. Then, fill a bowl with warm water. Submerge the pomegranate in this water bath. This will prevent the bright red juice from staining your clothes and everything around if any seeds burst. Then, gently crack the pomegranate open along the score lines. Then just pull each section outward. There's a way to hold a burger without it falling apart in your hands. Put your three middle fingers on top and your pinky and thumb at the bottom. This will keep all the filling inside. Pulling the trash out of the can or putting inside a new plastic bag may turn out to be very tricky. But by drilling a few holes in the trash can, you can make this task much easier. This way, air can enter the trash can beneath the seal of the plastic bag. It'll make it impossible for the bag to vacuum pack itself into the can. Try eating your cheesy snacks with the help of chopsticks. This way, there won't be any grease on your fingers. If you stash away your garbage bags, fold them into a neat origami triangle. This will save you space. The right way to eat a cupcake is munching on it like you would a sandwich. First, pull the cupcake out of the wrapper. After that, break off the bottom of the pastry and place it on top. This will allow you to enjoy the frosting in every bite. Some boxes of chocolates have little dents in between the holes for candies. If you push such a dent, the chocolate surrounding it will pop out of their compartments. If you need to microwave two bowls at the same time, place one of them on top of a cup. When munching on chicken wings, debone them by holding, twisting, and pulling out the two bones. After opening a cereal box, some people transfer its entire contents into a separate container. Others fold the plastic and put the bag back in the box, hoping to finish it before the cereal goes stale. But here's another, much better technique. Here you go, as simple as that. When using a blender, fill it with the liquids first. Only after adding your milk, coconut water, or yogurt, put berries inside, fruit, or spinach. When you're crossing out some words, don't just draw lines over them. This won't help if someone wants to figure out what you wrote. Instead, write other letters over the words. 
hold your piece of pizza so that it forms a U-shape. This will prevent the thing from flopping over. You can usually find some silica gel in bags, shoes, and many other things you buy. This gel is placed there to absorb excess moisture. Don't throw the packages with the gel away. Every time your shoes get wet, place the gel inside. Your shoes will dry much faster than they would otherwise. From now on, you can skip the chip clip. Here's a fast way to keep your snacks fresh. Just make several folds to prevent the bag from opening, like this. Ranger rolling, which means rolling up clothes while packing, can help you save a lot of space in your suitcase. It'll also protect your things from wrinkles and make your bag more organized. Use this method for pants, t-shirts, pajamas, swimsuits, and casual clothes. Unfortunately, it doesn't work for oversized clothes like sweaters. You can use a clothing or tension rod to hang spray bottles inside the bathroom cabinet and save space. The hole in a ruler can be useful if you want to hang the device on a hook. You can also place a pencil tip in this hole if you need to draw a perfect circle. If you need to fill a container with water and it doesn't fit in your sink, a dustpan will come in handy. Just position it in a way that will funnel the water straight into the container below. Instead of slicing a watermelon, try cutting it crosswise. Now you have a convenient way of eating a watermelon stick and the juice won't make a mess all around. By using ice cubes for your iced coffee, you dilute your drink and it loses its flavor. Try coffee cubes instead. They're very easy to prepare. Pour some coffee into the ice cube tray and freeze it. Apparently, there's even a correct way to eat chips. Nah, it's not as simple as popping them into your mouth. If we talk about such chips as Pringles, try placing them on your tongue with the concave side down. It's usually more flavorful than the other. Another trick, slide a long piece of paper into the can and then carefully pull it out. Here's your makeshift Pringles tray. A staple will effortlessly keep your key ring open while you tack on new keys. Most kitchen shears have metal plier-like teeth in the middle between the handle grips. They can help you crack nuts, crab shells, and other tough products. You can also open jars and bottles or remove herb stems with their help. The easiest way to eat mangoes is by cutting them into cubes. This way, you don't even need to peel the fruit. To untie a knot really fast, twist the loose end as much as you can and push it through the knot. The best way to peel a banana is by starting from the bottom where the black spot is. This makes the whole experience much neater. No more squished bananas and annoying strings. Sometimes you need to get away from your computer, but don't want to keep logging back in. Put your mouse over the top of an analog watch. The mouse will perceive the ticking second hand's movement, and this will prevent your computer screen from turning black. Try breaking in your shoes by putting them on while wearing thick socks and then blow drying the tight areas. Activated bamboo charcoal can help you remove unpleasant odors and bacteria. Put it in a mesh bag and leave it in the room you need to freshen up. No more costly air purifiers. You can keep your cold meals cold and your food fresh by making a DIY ice pack. Take a sponge and fill it with water, then put it in a plastic bag and leave it in the freezer. Once the sponge is frozen, it'll stay this way for a long time. Keep in mind that you should use a watertight bag and a fresh sponge. You can reuse your old curtain rings by placing them on a hanger. Then put your scarves or anything else that will fit through them. This will help you save space and make it easier for you to look through the things in your wardrobe. 